Live in the region have already spent time this week cleaning up storm damage from the weekend. Property damage from any new storm concerns, of course, could be a headache for both insurance companies and customers that are filing claims. Our Caleb Yager joins us now in the studio. Caleb had a chance to catch up with uh, some insurance company owners and uh, they've been bombarded, Caleb, with calls. Yes, absolutely, Eva. To say the least, that's what wind gusts at 60 miles an hour will do to you. These past couple of weeks, we've seen the weather do some significant damage, and insurance companies have had their hands quite full. Last Saturday, high winds and severe weather led to lots of damage in the area, like here on West 29th Street. This tree right here, or at least what's left of it, is one of several instances that have resulted from this recent inclement weather, which means that insurance companies are getting a lot of calls. This past Saturday, I know in our immediate area, there were over 400 claims filed. What about the previous weekend? Uh, same, same situation. This influx of claims for local businesses, such as Great Lakes Insurance Services Group and North Shore Insurance Agency, has given them an unusual spring. You always expect it to an extent, but this year has definitely been the worst in recent history. Insurance carriers, one thing they're doing is they recognize that they are bringing in outside adjusters um, so we can, you know, have the manpower to adjust the claims. There definitely has been an increase, you know, especially the wind. I think, you know, the biggest claims that we're seeing more lately are wind and trees down. Sales manager Mark Majeski strongly urges to take proper steps when filing a claim. Well, my first recommendation is contact your insurance agent, advise them you know, what happened, what the damage is, and definitely take photos. That's very important because you want to document exactly what happened and what was damaged. Most importantly, stay safe. Do anything you, reasonable steps to mitigate further damage. Um, definitely don't put yourself in harm's way. Um, if you're not able to complete temporary repairs yourself, uh, there are restoration companies that can assist with that. And if you see bad weather coming, batten down the hatches. Mark Majeski also reminded me that it's good to watch the weather. Be prepared for these kinds of instances, which includes today. So it may be good to keep this in your back pocket. Reporting live from the studio, Caleb Yager, Erie News Now.